a load of debt is heaped on the National Road Fund Agency, NRIFA. The 2017 audit report has revealed serious financial irregularities, mostly on huge debt acquired from various institutions coupled with failure to pay contractors for various road contracts and waste for expenditure. The report first reviews that the Ministry of Finance Permanent Secretary on 7th November 2014 appointed seven members of staff in the Ministry of Finance to act as board members of NRIFA, which has been cited as irregular in that National Road Fund Act number 13 of 2002 provided for the appointment of one representative from various institutions and that the appointing authority is the minister and not the permanent secretary. The irregularly appointed board members were also illegally paid sitting and quarterly fees in amounts totaling 563,860 kwacha. The NRFA and National Pensions Authority financing agreement of 2017 seems to have brought more harm than good. Despite NRFA getting a loan totaling 2 billion, 126 million 552,026 kwacha from NAPSA with a repayment period of 10 years, it has been defaulting, thereby attracting huge penalties. And despite it having been decided that in the event NRIFA failed to fulfill its obligations under the agreement, NAPSA would manage and directly receive the monies from the toll gates on the corridor, including the Shimawala, Manyumbi, Kafula Futa, and Katua toll plazas, funds realized could not meet the target and a balance of 1,745,538,000 395 kwacha was recorded as only 474,763,824 kwacha had been collected as at 31st December 2018. Failure by NRIFA to make timely monthly repayments for the acquired loan attracted a deduction of 1,319,255 kwacha in penalties during the period from December 2017 to October 2018. Another record of failure to pay contractors on time resulted in two contractors claiming a total of 35,052,442 kwacha as of October 2018. Variations in scope of works and price adjustments saw the total NAPSA corridor contract sum increase to 3 billion 165 million 970,000 476 kwacha from the original combined total figure of 2 billion 481 million 725,819 kwacha for the four contracts. Another 100 and 39 contractors countrywide were being owed 11 billion 341 million 277 thousand 405 kwacha and another 799 million 201 thousand 644 kwacha owed to consultants as of November 2018. As a result of this non-payment, five contractors have either suspended or terminated the road contracts contractual costs relating to monthly basic needs for those that spend days on site, a cost of 560 million, 59,503 kwacha was incurred for eight road projects. Having International Zambia Limited on the other hand had been engaged to construct the Michael Shilufiasata, Choma and Kaflafuta toll plazas at a total cost of 120 million, 510,272 kwacha and with a completion period of seven months, but that there was a balance of 8,412,050 kwacha, which led to the contractor abandoning works at Choma and Kaflafuta toll plazas. As regards West for expenditure, 46 contractors claimed penalties in amounts exceeding 440 million kwacha as NRFA delayed in settling claims made by the said contractors. Another 4,535,052 United States dollars in penalty charges was outstanding in the Mansell Wing Road project, despite the project having been funded through a loan from Exim Bank of China. 
This are some of the financial regularities as highlighted in the released audit report for the financial year ending 31st December 2017. Mwapekumwenda, Prime TV News, Lusaka.